Hi, my name is Justine Ramos. And my name is Alyssa Thompson, and we will be giving you an outline of our project of Zodiac Aerospace. The name of our senior project is Analysis and Improvement of the Decoratives Department at Zodiac Aerospace. For our senior project, we will be collaborating with Zodiac Aerospace, who is a world leader in aerospace equipment and systems on board commercial, regional, and business aircrafts, as well as helicopters. The company is divided into five business segments, which include cabin and structures, seats, galleys and equipment, aircraft systems, aero safety. For our project, we will be focusing on cabin and structures. We will be working with CND Zodiac Incorporated, located in Santa Maria, California. CND Zodiac specializes in the production and development of onboard systems, safety systems, and cabin interiors, and provides for customers like Boeing and Airbus. CND Zodiac moved into their current facility in 2005. With the new facility, there has not yet been a chance to analyze the decoratives department. CND Zodiac's Decoratives Department has been overlooked since their move to the new Skyway facility. Currently, the department lacks efficient product flow and overall organization. There is also a communication deficiency that inhibits a clear understanding of the supplier's inputs, processes, outputs, and customers of the department. This is the current layout of the Decoratives Department at CND Zodiac. In order to have a deeper understanding of the current lean manufacturing tools and previously used techniques, we have conducted extensive research. This research includes the following topics. The concept of lean, which is a very broad topic, so we decided to break this section up into several different subsections, including 5S plus 1 analysis, Six Sigma analysis, and lean implementation models. We are also investigating the concept of value stream mapping, the concept of a visual factory and facility layout and design, as well as the current market for facility enhancements. Now we will give you an overview of the methodology approach that we will be using throughout the course of this project. Define, measure, analyze, improve, and control, more commonly known as DMAIC, is a structured problem-solving method. Each phase of this method builds on the previous one with the goal of imp implementing long-term solutions and current issues. In the first phase of the DMAIC methodology, we will be laying out the foundation for our project. Here we, will be accurately, here we will accurately define the problem, identify all stakeholders within the department, and conduct extensive research to determine the tools we will need to help us reach our end goal. The second phase of the DMAIC method is known as the measuring phase. Here we will use the tools defined by our research and knowledge from our previous coursework to, to identify and document the current product flow through the department as well as other processes that are necessary to carry out the work. The third phase will analyze our findings. Here we will look at the critical inputs and outputs that drive the performance of the decoratives department. The fourth phase is also known as the improve phase, where we will plan on identifying and evaluating potential solutions in order to optimize product flow through the department. The final phase is also known as the control phase, where we hope to establish standard operating procedures for other processes under evaluation. Control plans will also be established with reaction plans, and ownership and control will be transferred to the process owner. For the first time since the move to the Skyway facility, the focus on improving efficiency and effectiveness of the decoratives department is in the spotlight. In order to assist C&D Zodiac, we plan to perform a full analysis of the department in order to ensure that they continue to improve to provide high quality products while maintaining operational efficiency and effectiveness. Some of the deliverables we hope to provide for Zodiac at the end of our project are as follows. We would like to provide a clear understanding of the CPOC of the department, to improve the product flow through the decoratives department, to improve how product is stored and queued, improve the overall design of the production line, and finally we hope to assist Zodiac in the implementation of a new production line design. As of today, we have submitted our project proposal as well as the final copy of our literature review. We have also visited the Skyway facility in Santa Maria, California during our visit of the facility and during our visit of the facility we met with our point of contact Aaron Buckley who showed us the entire facility including the decoratives department 
At that time, we were able to become more familiar with the various departments and the interworkings of the manufacturing facility as a whole. We were also able to discuss the project with our client and come to a consensus on key performance indicators as well as expected deliverables. During our time at the facility, we were able to become better acquainted with the dynamic of the department and some of the issues that they are currently facing. In order to successfully complete our project, we have set up a timeline that will carry us into the next quarter. Looking at the timeline, you can see that our next steps are to complete the measuring phase, which includes making further observations, conducting a time study, and creating various flow processes, charts, and diagrams. Next, we hope to analyze the data and then propose our alternative solutions and recommendations to our client. After presenting our recommendations, our goal is to assist Zodiac in the beginning stages of implementation by May 12th, to construct control plans by May 19th, and submit the final draft of our written report no later than June 6th. That concludes our senior project presentation. Thank you for your time and attention.